I was going to show you guys a little painter's trick, or maybe it's not even that much of a trick anymore, but there's other types of ways that you can do it, but to seal off a window like this, where it has an outside edge on these little Toyota trucks, you can peel it up fairly easy, and this is a 1981, and it's actually really pliable still. I had already done the front yesterday, and I, what I am able to do is just lift that up. You can actually see that I put a piece of quarter inch rope underneath it. It's like a clothesline rope that you can get. And just go buy it at Lowe's or Home Depot or any store really that sells rope. Always make sure you burn the tip of it so you don't get frays coming off of the side. But what you're going to do is lift up. See? And then start tucking that in all the way down. And you can actually get the whole whole one piece and then just come all the way around and then cut off that piece, burn the end, and then tuck it in. And then you have a raised edge all the way around and it will fit in. And then you can come just like I did on the front and you tape over that with a little bit of overhang and then you're able to tuck that back in. And so now, instead of having the seal laying directly on the metal, you'll have that little quarter inch up, go ahead and back mask over the top, fold that edge underneath by the rope, and then you have a lifted edge, so you do not have a hard edge when you, uh, or, or a you know it can it can bridge the paint can bridge over here and it just makes it a lot easier to mask off it makes the whole process a, a lot easier for uh, in the long run so it takes a little time to stuff it in there you can get a tool if you can't use your finger you can get a little screwdriver in there with wrapped in tape so you don't hurt the the metal and guide it with one hand in the front of you and then your piece of rope being stuffed underneath